Okay, so problem 22 says that a spherical raindrop evaporates at a rate proportional to its surface area. And we have to write a differential equation with respect to time describing our change in volume. So that means that if our change in volume is proportional, we'll say proportional to our surface area, that means the derivative is equal to some constant times the surface area. We don't know this constant, but it's just a constant for proportionality. Well, what do we know about surface area? Well, surface area is, we want to get this to involve, we want this to be V, not our surface area. That's what we want. Because then we have an actual differential equation, but as long as it's a surface area, we don't really have a very good differential equation. Uh, because then we're dealing with different variables. Well, surface area is simply 4 pi r squared, right? And our volume, as we know, is also 4 thirds pi r cubed. So then, we can actually solve this equation for, from we can solve our v equation for r, and we get r is equal to, or r cubed, is equal to 3v over 4 pi. So then r equals the cube root of 3v over 4 pi. Well then, we can go back and plug that into our surface area, area equation. Because right now we have v of t is equal to k, 4 pi r squared. Well, notice we have an r here, an r here we can just plug in, and then we have an equation in terms of v. So v prime of t is equal to k 4 pi. I'm going to write this as 3v over 4 pi to the 2 thirds power. And what I can actually even do here is simplify a little bit more and say that this is going to be 4 to the 1 third, pi to the 1 third, and then this will be 3v to the 2 thirds. Well, notice that really 4 to the 1 third, pi to the 1 third is just part of a constant, right? It's just a constant. And this k is an arbitrary constant. So we can actually consume our, we can consume this 4 and the pi and actually put it into the k. So I'm just going to call this like a capital K to denote that it's bigger. Um, 3v to the 2 thirds power. So that is the differential equation that describes the volume of this evaporating raindrop. Check back on my channel for more videos about differential equations.